right guys, we are out in Maslin today, again at the Maslin Kmart to do an update. Uh, a lot of people have been requesting I do updates on things that I have filmed before. There it is in the background, and we're gonna go take a close up look after I get some pictures from out here at the street. So there it is, from one side to the other. Man, I got a lot of memories from this place. This was my Kmart. And out here in the front, you can see they still have the sign up even though they've blacked it out. We'll get as close as we can there. I, I don't think you can see anything through the black there. Maybe on the video you'll be able to. But that's what we got right there. We still got the unleaded sign up there because you can see, even though there is nothing over here, there used to be a Kmart Express out front here. I actually have a picture of that in my office. And if you remember, not too long ago, both Wally and Richard, possibly a couple other people, I honestly don't remember, they came out here and filmed and documented where somebody had like run into, totally crashed into the little building that was out there. So, um, yeah, this is it right here. We're gonna get a closer look and, uh, and check out the whole thing. See if we can't find some kind of little K remnants out here. You never know when there might be like a sign or something. I see some garbage up there. You know, there's always people dumping off garbage. What is this? Old Carolina Q card. I don't know what the heck that thing is, but let's go on up here and see what we can see. Yeah, we can see some label scars up here. Like just starting down here, we got a garden center. And like I said, we'll get close ups of these. Garden center down here. Those would have been signs for like the, uh, I don't know, outdoor equipment stuff, D-Bold and things like that, I think it said. You can see, obviously, the big K scar up there. Over here, we got the pharmacy. And somewhere, I believe it was right here, to the right of the pharmacy, that would have been the Little Caesars sign, I'm thinking. And there was... I wonder what this was down here. If this was like where they had big store closing signs or something, I honestly don't remember. Yeah, I just don't remember, but there was obviously something there. I'll have to look back and see for my old videos what it was. See if there's anything. Nah, kind of surprised there's no trash dumped back here. Maybe around the back of the building, but Anytime I step over to this area, I always think about when I used to come out here as a teenager with my friends and we would go karting. And I've told this story before, probably when I was out here, but karting is when you pull into a parking lot after hours and you take a stray cart and put it in front of your car and just gun it and then let it just fly. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid, but fun. Yeah, look at this, guys. Kmart is not responsible for cart damage. I love it. Leave it there. I'm always afraid anytime I film this stuff, people are going to come by and steal this stuff because that's just what they do. I mean, because honestly, I can see how cool that is, you know? Maybe when somebody else buys this place or, or goes to rent it or something... Then you can come down here and, and try to get it. But for now, just leave it there. Let other explorers come out here and, and uh, appreciate it. There's the big K sign. That's a big one, too. I think that one's even bigger than the one in North Canton. I mean, not North Canton, out there on Route 62, the one I did an update on the other day. That's pretty huge. But all right, let's see. We got the front doors here, and surprisingly, we're still going to be able to look in through this window. Oh man, we can see a little bit. Not very much, but... Alright, there we go. We can see a little bit more that way. Yeah, just big, open, empty space now. Word. Yeah, if I were to come out here at night, um, we'd be able to see in there a lot better. I can just barely even see in there as it is. 
um, because of the reflection. But I did notice over here a little possible Kmart gem. Let's see what this is. It's falling apart, but... I don't know, it appears to be some kind of a... It was a tag, at least. <laughs> Alright, let's keep on walking down here, guys. Step out here and look at these label scars down this way, too. There's the big K again. Here somebody's dumped off some junk, as usual. But up here, yeah, that's where those other signs were. Um, hold on a second. I should know what that says up there. You can clearly see where there were some letters. I don't know why my brain is not allowing me to know what that says. But over here, garden shop. All right, I don't see, yeah. Here's another one of those Kmart signs. In fact, there's one, two, three of them in a row. Kmart is not responsible for cart damage. I am not looking in that. Although that does look like there's like a Steelers jersey or something in there. Sorry, Wally, I'm not digging. <laughs> All right, let's go on down here. Yeah, it looks like there was another one of those signs right here and somebody's already swiped that. But there's the garden shop sign. I don't think we can see in these windows here, but let's try. I think they're, yeah, they got something over the windows. Yep, just paper. You can see though how it's got moisture damage on the uh, on the paper that's covering the windows. I remember working in there. All right. Let's go out here a second. Up there's where the big K sign for the garden shop. We got the Kmart logo still on the door there. And again, moisture damage on the paper. Here's our prison yard. This is a smaller one than some of them I've seen, especially like that one out on Route 62. That one's like three times the size at least. Those doors over there would go inside. They used to have all those like... Uh, Things for outdoors out here, like the, the plant pots and, uh, you know, the concrete trim and uh, kids' little swimming pools and stuff like that, you know. All right, we're not going to go around the back of the, the Kmart there, but here out in front of me is where the Express used to be. You can see the footprint of the whole thing. This is where it used to be, the pumps. And the little building, I believe, was right here, if I'm not mistaken. And yeah, you'll have to look back at, uh, at Wally and Richard's videos to see. But somebody had just come flying through up here and wrecked right into the thing. That doesn't seem right. Maybe it was more like over here somewhere. It seems like a much smaller area now that there's nothing here. That is so weird. And once again, here we got the unleaded sign. And that's where it said Big K up there. The sun is right in my eyes, so I can't tell if you can still see it at all through that black. But hopefully on the camera the other side. I mean, you can still see a little bit of color up there. There's some blue shining through. But there it is. One more time, guys. Big K in all its glory. Let me get this pole out of the way here so you can see the front better. 
Maslin, Ohio. This was my big K. Used to work here, used to shop here. Had pictures taken here at Olin Mills. Used to stand up there ringing things up and getting chafed. <laughs> Standing there for hours, my legs burning. Let's just look one more time at this area of the parking lot, see if there's any K remnants up here. And I don't see any. All I see is the signs for the uh, reserved parking. And I don't recall there being any Kmart stuff uh, painted in the parking lot out here. I think the only thing that there was was when they had the cart corrals out here. And they had the signs on top of those. So that's it, guys. There it is. Big K. Okay, and real quick before we go, just looking at the sign one more time from a distance here. You can see it better from a distance. You can see the swipe. You can see the swipe there that would be under the big with the K underneath it. The blue on top would be where it said big. And underneath it would say uh, there would be a big K down there. So you can sort of see that. If all that black wasn't there, you'd still see it.